our first small town with big tastes restaurant segment and we're at Siegel's Ice Cream in Harwichport and we're right across from Cape Cod 5 and TD Bank. We're going to go in and uh, spend some time at a sweet and fun spot in Harwichport. Hi, welcome to Seagulls. Hey, thanks so much, uh, Connor. Um, we're super excited to learn all about Seagulls, share it with our viewers. Um, we're here um, going to learn about one of their signature sundaes. Hopefully I don't eat while I'm making it. But um, they have so many wonderful flavors, um, soft serve. Tell us about some of the specialties that make you stand out um, with, I mean, we have four ice cream shops in Harwich. But what's Seagulls different for? Other than um, what I hear and see right in front of me, cotton candy. Um, you also have soda, candy, cookies, all kinds of great things. But what else is special? So we have a lot of uh, really cool ice cream flavors. And our menu is highly customizable. We have a lot of different toppings. And we have soft serve, which uh, not every shop at Harwich has. You can also incorporate any of those toppings into your soft serve and make like a cyclone with the toppings mixed in. Oh, great. And we also have 28 different flavors of soft serve. So there's wow. a so lot of different options. it's not just options. vanilla and chocolate or a twist. Right. It's 28 different flavors. We also have flavors. pineapple Dole Whip, which is vegan and delicious. So you really, I mean, ice cream's for everyone. Really? We do. Well, if you're ready, I'm ready. You want to take sure. a Sunday? Absolutely. So this is really cool. I'm behind the counter now. We're getting ready, Connor and I. He's going to show us how to make one of their signature sundaes. At the end, we're going to see how well I really follow directions here. So I'm ready, Connor. Cool. All of our signature sundaes start in this big banana boat. We like to make sure there's lots of room for the generous size scoops and all the toppings that we put on. Fantastic. So let's head over. These are all of our ice cream flavors. We have them labeled so that way it's easy to find in the freezer. Do you have a favorite flavor you want to try? Oh, let's see. Well, since my daughter loves salted caramel, I'm going to go with the salted caramel. That is our pretzel. most popular. All right. I'm going to go a little more basic and do Oreo. Okay, I'm going to make sure I don't... Perfect. I'm just making myself right at home. I'm just digging right in. Absolutely. <laughs> oh, of course, I picked the one that is super, super frozen. Oh, that one's brand new. That one's perfect But I'm for making scooping. my muscles work for sure. Now, how many scoops do you guys put in these? So these are going to have three scoops. Okay. You want to make sure they're good-sized scoops, but just big enough to fit inside the Sunday boat, too. All right. Don't so. be cheeping out on those scoops. <laughs> I didn't eat my weenies this morning, Connor. <laughs> you get those muscle, those ice cream scooping muscles after a little while. All right, it's not as pretty, but I've got my three scoops. That's okay. And then I'm going to put this back in the water. Absolutely. Fantastic. Oh, see, now you definitely look at that compared to mine. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're making our shark attack signature sundae. That's now, our most popular shark signature attack. sundae. There aren't sharks in Harwich. Come on. All around Cape Cod. <laughs> okay, no shark beach attack. is safe. So now we're going in for some sharks. And he said I can put as many. Oh, well, load it up. We like to be generous. Clearly, I'm making a mess, but I'm trying to balance it too. So here we go. So they're going to look like they're in the water. So there's that. Perfect. For you. I like to tuck them in on the sides, so that way they don't fall out on people. But that's okay. You went a little cheap on the ice cream, so you have room for it. I know, right? That extra muscle, you know, trying to get that going. Now we're going to go over to our fridge and add the strawberry sauce. Oh, fabulous. Perfect. And the strawberry sauce will be right in here. Okay. And you can do two generous spoons of... This is messy, Connor. 
very messy. Messy to make, messy to eat, but delicious. It looks like it's going to be. Perfect. I'll add some to mine. So as you can see, we've got some ice, uh, Shark Attack ice cream sundae going. Connor's teaching me how to make it. Well, we'll see. I don't know. Life. See, his is, he's the professional. And we have a few more toppings. So with the Shark Attack, we add crushed pretzels too. Okay. So go ahead and add a few spoonfuls of those. A little salty to break up the sweet. Perfect. The shop itself is so colorful and full of so much goodness. I'm looking at all of the jars and the bottles. I mean, here we've got like fruity pebbles. We've got brownies, gummy bears, little M&Ms, Reese's Pieces, and then all the different nuts that you could ask for as well. But wow, you guys really, I can remember when you opened, this has just come so far. And it's such a great piece of hardware for it. You've added a lot to Thank it. So I'm really proud of you guys for sure. We so really want to make sure that we have a lot of different options because we think it's disappointing when you go somewhere and they only have three or four types of toppings. You want to be able to customize it. And, you know, you're going to an ice cream shop to feel like a kid again and mm -hmm. to get that fun experience. We want to make sure that you can get what you want. And everyone has their own taste and their own, you know, like when you come in here, what an imagination you can have. You know, I mean, look at what we're making with this. It's just, and I'm looking at the board of all the different flavors and the toppings. You can, you can get super creative with what you're having. You know, it doesn't, doesn't matter if you're mixing, you know, nuts with berries or, you know, it's just, I mean, the salt, of, uh, the hard flavors, the uh, soft serve, there's just, like you said, there's so much and it's, You've done a great job with the variety Thank and giving people the options because you know you, you do you want it you know each family member may not like vanilla or chocolate but now they can have 26 other choices too exactly. so it's it's great so what are we adding next we're almost done okay we have whipped cream and a cherry Ooh. so all let's right. test your whipped cream skills <laughs> oh this ought to be fun do you want me to go first oh you know let me see if I can pull this off. There you go. Give it so a good I'm shake. Give it a good shake. Yeah. All right. Yeah, getting the top off with rubber gloves is the trick. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And just and then, give it a good. All right. Perfect. I'm going to give it another shake just to make sure. <laughs> I like to go left to right if you're reading a book. Okay. Oh, so now. I'm clearly the messy of the two ice cream artists. And the last thing, if you want a cherry, okay. you can top it off with a cherry. Excellent. So we're going to reach in with the tong. All right, so I like even numbers, and clearly two came out, so I'm going it's with two. To there we go. I'll give you the... Perfect. There we have it, Shark Attack Sundays. So there we go. These are Shark Attack Sundays. I'm thinking Connor is definitely a more elegant ice cream artist <laughs> than I. But this was a lot of fun. But I want to actually put these down and just take a little tour around the shop and show everybody what you have here. And, uh, you know, put these down. Sure. Share. Um, There's one last thing we want to add to this that really makes oh. the magic. All right. Well, here we go now. And that is our color changing oh, spoons. Love these spoons. So there we so go. So they change color with the cold. And we wanted to make sure to have a really strong spoon because right. there's nothing worse than going to an ice cream shop and, and your spoon breaking. bends and breaks. Yeah. So a lot of people take these spoons home and rewash them so that way that so look, uh, you can look use it for at cereal. Yours is turning and mine, all right, so because I was stingy with the ice cream, it's not <laughs> turning. But that is so cool. The pink now turns to, pink purple. to purple. Mine, all right, well, like I said. And we have a lot of different colors. We rotate through the colors for the color changing spoons. And I think always I like just got ice cream on my nose. <laughs> <laughs> it happens. <laughs> but let's take a walk through and highlight some of the 
other things that you have here. Sure, so this is our picture wall. Love a that. lot of people come and take selfies. We actually had a local artist come and paint this because we like to support the local artist industry as well. Other small crafters. Great. So this corner on the other side, while people are waiting for their ice cream or to decide what they want for their ice cream, um, you've got a great collection here. Um, love all of the different options. Pre-bagged um, candy, whether or not you want mini sharks that like you're going to have on your Sunday, but you also have Charleston chews, some chocolate seashells, all the little penny candy options that we all love as children. You guys have already put it together here for everyone to grab a bag. You've got um, double bubble bubble gum, root beer barrels, the banana runs, jawbreakers. Uh, wax bottles, which is our most popular penny candy, and then uh, bullseyes. We have a lot of different options. And then you've got the uh, merchandise too. So, you know, for all of us Seagull fans, you've got the baseball caps, beach bag. Yep. Because we are here with uh, in Harwich with our 21 beaches. Why not take a Seagull's beach Absolutely. bag to one of the 21 beaches, right? T-shirts, and then great keychains. And then for everyone, too, um, they can pick up your um, business card, but the QR code. Now, can they order right online with a QR code? So, like, say it's a rainy night or cold night. Don't feel like going out. I've already got my PJs on and slippers. They could go on and order. They can order. order on our website. We do DoorDash, Grubhub, and uh, Uber Eats. I mean, so how cool is that? You we get a fine ice cream with all the toppings, and there you go. <laughs> Absolutely. Wonderful. Well, anything else you want to show us other than the variety of ice cream flavors? Um, the board is fabulous. Um, what else do we want to share with uh, everyone watching today? Uh, one other really cool thing that kids love is our gumball machine. I forgot to show the gumball machine. Yes. So this gumball machine was actually from my Nana's candy store. And she used to do a promotion where there's baseball gumballs. And if you look inside, you can see we have some baseball gumballs, oh, too. Oh, that's fabulous. And if you get a baseball gumball, then we give you a free small soft serve. So we're continuing the tradition using a very old school gumball machine. And kids love to try and win that free ice cream. That is wonderful. And like you said, bring, you know, bringing in your family with the tradition that you know you grew up with her candy store now it's here in your ice cream shop what a better uh, way to you know honor her too and have her be part of your adventure um, and you and Ron have just done such an incredible um, job here for anyone watching this used to be Bonette's Bakery and uh, Connor and Ron took over, came in, and made it the ice cream shop it is today, and uh, we're so happy to have you here. Thank you. Um, we wouldn't be here without you. Well, thank you, and we're just uh, happy to have you as our first episode of Small Town with Big Tastes. Thanks, and have a great day.